ஆஸ்திரேலியாவே ஸ்ரீலங்காராமே விசாக் மகோத்சவ மே மாசே ஹய ஹத் தினவல அதி உத்கிருஷ்டவ ஆக்காரேன் சமரன்னட்டு எதுனா விசேஷேன்ம அதி பூஜ்ய பத்தேகம தம்மாவாச நாயக்க இமிபானே பிரதான பிரிஸ்மேன் ஒரு விசேன பௌத்த ஜனதாவ விஷால சங்கியாவ மே தவசி வெடிசட்டான் வரிட்டு சாபாகிவன அத்தியாலங்காரவ மே பூமிய சரசல சம்பாதனை கரல திபுனா ஏக்கம யௌவன சங்கிதானே விஷன் ஆலோக பூஜாவ இதாம சுந்தரவ பூமியை சிதுகல விஷால ஜனதாவ சபாகித்தவ சிதுனுமி வெடிசட்டானே தவ சுவிசேஷ அங்கக்குனே விசாக் பக்தி காயனைய பகத்தீம யௌவன யௌவனியன் இத்த உணந்தேன் சாபாகிவன மே வெடிசட்டான்ட்டு தெமோப்பிய விஷால சங்கியாவ நரமீம சாபாகிரஹிட்டிய ஏக்கம ஏ அவஸ்தாவட் சமகாமீவ இத்தாம சமத்கார பிரதர் பெரஹராக் சங்கிதானே கரல திபுனா ஹரியட்ட மே ஸ்ரீலாங்கீக லக்ஷண வலின் கானவ மந்தக்க மே அப்பி அரகனையான கொடி தாஜ பதாக்க ஸ்ரீலங்காவை பெருஹார அல்வல ஏ ஆக்கார நிர்மாணி கரல மே பெருஹர இத்தாம ராசன்ட சாங்கிதானி கரல திபுனா and I know I join with councillor Charles Strunk our local councillor and the premier of Queensland the honorable Anastasia Palajay who asked me to pass on her best wishes as the local elected representatives how privileged we are to have the monastery in our electorates in our community the way you serve the way you look after but also the way you celebrate I'd like to take this opportunity to thank the Buddhist monastery for inviting my wife Bronwyn and me. We have had a warm relations for over 30 years and 
I have been here from the beginning and I could see the advancement it's made over these years. And this, of course, through the leadership of the Nayakatero. Thank you for your leadership and inspiration to the Sri Lankan community. Hatvini Irida Patan Lade Sil Samadami Be Varisatanade Vishala Pirisaki Sabagitin Darman Shala Be Patan Eduna Samastak Kashin Genebalanavita Meda Sri Lanka Rame Varisatana Chitta Karshaniya Samadhiya, Vadena, Satutin Perunu, Sadhavatunge, Truktiatu, Vasanavanta, Dawasak Bhavata, Penigya. The Speaker of the House of Representatives of Queensland, Mr. Milton Dick, participated as the chief guest of the Vesak celebrations at the Sri Lanka Ramaya. Here he addressed the gathering. And I know I join with Councillor Charles Strunk, our local councillor, and the Premier of Queensland, the Honourable Anastasia Palajay, who asked me to pass on her best wishes. As the local elected representatives, how privileged we are to have the monastery in our electorates, in our community the way you serve, the way you look after, but also the way you celebrate. And Vasak Festival tonight is our favourite time of the year. I'd like to thank the Secretary of the Sri Lankan Buddhist Monastery for inviting the distinguished guests here tonight. And I'm so proud and privileged to join with my friend, the Honourable, Co the Honourable Consul General for Sri Lanka, Mr. Anton Swan and his wife, Mrs. Bronwyn Swan, who are such supporters of this monastery and all things Sri Lankan, but also a deep commitment to multiculturalism. And I know that we all thank Mr. Swan for his dedication and service for so many decades. On Vasak Day, millions of Buddhists from around the world commemorate the birth, enlightenment and passing of Lord Buddha. This is the most sacred day on the Buddhist calendar and a time to reflect on the Buddha's teaching and what it means to be Buddhist. Buddha's teachings of compassion, peace and goodwill have simply moved millions across the globe. They are now more important than ever as we come together to overcome unprecedented challenges here in Australia and across the world. As the local federal member for Oxley, I am proud to represent one of the most multicultural electorates in our country. And our community continue to embrace diversity and generously share their faith, embodying Buddha's timeless messages of unity and service to others. On the day of Vasak, I thank you for celebrating the Lord Buddha's wisdom by continuing to help build a peaceful world. I wish you all a peace. I wish you peace, prosperity and good health. I also have a very special message from the Prime Minister of Australia, who's asked me to read this message out to everyone here this evening. At Pasak, I'm delighted to send my warm greetings to the Buddhist faithful in Australia and around the world. This time of commemoration unites you in dedication to the Dharma of the Lord Buddha, his profound teaching and example of the path to enlightenment have been a source of inspiration and consolation for many. Australian Buddhists are a vital and vibrant part of our multi-faith, multicultural society. Sharing the Buddha's birthday Message, the Buddha's message of peace and happiness, you bring the wisdom and compassion of your faith to our lives. As communities across Australia gather and honour the birth, enlightenment and passing of the Buddha, may this auspicious day be filled with hope and joy. The Honourable Anthony Albanese, Prime Minister of Australia. So in conclusion, thank you. Thank you to our venerable monks 
are leaders in our community for all that you do, for sharing, caring and showing the tolerance that this monastery is well known for. It's an honour to serve you as you serve our community. Thank you everyone and have a wonderful evening.